Hey fam, it's your girl Miss Diva Trucker and I'm coming to you today to show you how to make bread and butter pickles, right, from your cu cucumbers. So, if you are growing your cucumbers in the yard or if you go to the store and just buy you some cucumbers, you can buy them like this, right? You can buy your cucumbers like that or if you're growing them in the yard, you can make your own pickles you can make your own pickles for your hamburgers you can make your own pickles for um your sandwiches and it's really really simple so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna show you how to make your own homemade pickles okay this what what it is i'm doing is first of all if you're making the um if you're making the um the uh, chips, all you got to do is just cut these up in just little slices, right? Take off the end, throw that away. Take off that end, throw that away. Cut it up into slices. The jars that I have, you can get these anywhere. You can get them at the tractor supply store. You can get them at Walmart. You can get them at basically anywhere. Kroger, just get you a case. It comes in a case of mason jars. Um, buy a ball, get you a case of these. You'll be fine, right? Okay, now there's a couple of ways that you can do this. You can do it really easy by just buying one of these do I, uh, the, uh, DIY um, kosher pickle deal. Or you could just buy your own ingredients and make it yourself, no problem, okay? But if you do this, all you have to do is pour it over it and you're good, okay? So once you cut up your cucumber, right? Um, I put onions in mine. If y'all can see, it's onions and garlic um, and peppers, okay? I got the peppers out of my, off of my tree. So you can take the peppers. These are my hot peppers. So I take the hot pepper and I cut up my hot peppers. And I also cut up garlic and I also cut up onion, okay, to put in there, right? So you take that. You put it in a little bowl or whatever, and then you're going to put in your kosher salt. So give me one second, and I'll show y'all um, the salt that you're going to use. I forgot to uh, leave that, to bring that out. Uh, where's my salt? Where's my kosher salt? Okay, you're going to have kosher salt. And I guess I put it up somewhere. So, oh, here it is, right here. Okay, I forgot my salt. Okay. So, you're going to have your kosher salt, right? Or pickle salt, or whatever the case may be, right? You're going to have that. You're going to spread it all over your cucumbers. Let it sit. Your cucumbers, your onions, your garlic, your pepper. Spread it all over that. Then, you know, like in a little container or whatever, you can put it in a little container. Put it in the refrigerator for about two to four hours um, to take the water out of the cucumber. Once you do that, right, you're going to rinse it off, rinse all of that salt off and everything. Rinse it off. Now you're ready. Now, I got this, which is piss, pickle crisp granules. And what it is, it keeps your pickles from being soft like they'll be real crispy right and you just take a little bit of it just a little bit of it and uh, put in your jar so that your pickles will be very crispy okay now you can have it where you add your vinegar and stuff like that this is really simple right where you add your vinegar sugar and this right here and it will make your bread and butter pickles or you can get it already made right this is the juices and everything that you will have and all you have to do is pour it over okay so after you take it out you can add different stuff now if you're doing it from homemade i have stuff that i added which is um the mustard seed i have red peppers in there i have a little bit of turmeric turmeric will give you that yellow color that you want okay so turmeric will give you that yellow color that you want and i have what else i have in here turmeric uh garlic onion 
uh, mustard seed, uh, a little dill, just a little bit, right? And um, um, basically, that's, that's it. But if you use it from here, you're going to have to put, if you use the pack, right? If you use this pack, you're going to have to put um, um, your sugar, you're going to have to put your sugar and your, um, your mix and the vinegar, Okay, so you will have to add that to, to there if you want. Um, and I got the Miss Wages Pickling Cleaning a Can and Vinegar, okay? But if you just do this, okay, you may just... Oh, and I got red peppers. So I got red peppers. I got some peppers from um, off my plant, right? These peppers came off my plant. So I just cut them up and put them in there to make it a little bit spicy. And um, I poured it in the drawer, and I poured this over it, right? Real simple. You get that Walmart, $2, about a dollar something. Walmart, pour it over it, right? Seal it in a can. You can seal it by boiling it for a minute. And you can put your date on here, whatever the case may be. And within, like, 24 hours, they're ready. So I cut up my spears. You know, they're not perfect spears, but they're spears. I got my red pepper flakes. You can see that. Got my deal in there. You can see that. Okay. So, um, yeah, that's it. And put it in the refrigerator. And tomorrow we'll taste it and see uh, how it is. But uh, pickling is really simple. Now, tomorrow what I'm going to do is I am going to bring you a video of me canning, uh, making my own jams. So, I will start making strawberry jams. I got my strawberries in there. I got my own my containers my little jam containers right let me show y'all that these are my little jam jars so i will be making like strawberry jam grape jam all my little preserves and stuff in there and we're going to see how we're going to do the pickle test miss diva trucker uh pickles Okay, so if this goes well and people love them, we, I am going to put a label on it. And um, I'm going to put a label on it and we're going to go from there. How about that? So it's real simple. Uh, this is to make your pickles crispy. Salt to take out the water from the cucumbers. Uh, the little mix right here, right, to pour over. Uh, the the cucumbers and uh, a little pepper for some spice this came off of my tree there's my little tomato y'all see I got one little tomato okay so that came from out there and we're gonna go from there we'll see how it is right okay and um but you could do it however you want to um, you don't have to have all the peppers and stuff and onions and all that kind of stuff. If you don't want to, you could just have the juices. But um, I like to uh, make it a little different. So other than that, peace, love, joy, and happiness. And you guys have a wonderful day. So tomorrow I ordered my labels. And I will be putting labels on my uh, pickles after I taste them and make sure that they taste good absolutely wonderful all right you see the peppers those are my hot peppers in there okay other than that guys peace love joy and happiness and if you try it leave a comment let me know how you like it and i will talk to you guys later bye